Smells good. What's up my friends? Welcome to a new vlog. This one I think is in 4K. So let me know if you can tell the quality. See how this goes. If you were here yesterday, you saw that we were roasting garlic and it's now done. It's finished. I'm gonna show you what's underneath the hood. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, it's so hot. Whoa. Oh my. Yo, those actually look really good. What'd you say, Bubba? I can taste the smell. You can taste that That's smell. That's how strong it is. Dude, it is strong. You're gonna come try it? Some reeking breath. Come on, come try it with me. Oh, man. Come on. Let me pull up this article and read to you exactly what the health benefits were. We're doing this not because I love the taste of roasted garlic, but I read an article and we're gonna, this is like an experiment. Garlic is one of the most beneficial nourishments on the planet. This characteristic wonder can treat various illnesses and because it is, because of its intense therapeutic properties, it is utilized around the world. The claim is that garlic can heal your body in just 24 hours. First two to hours, it begins to obliterate disease cells and forestall free radical harm. In four to six hours, digestion starts uh, to perceive its gainful properties, so it helps the disposal of abundance of liquids and fat in the body. Hours six and seven, the antibacterial properties of garlic begin to work and pulverize any microbes found in the framework. Within 10 hours, the supplements found in garlic have given impacts on a cellular level, so the body is shielded, so is not shielded from oxidants, oxidations. Enhanced bone quality. Helps lifespan of the cells, kills weariness so it produces more energy, managed cholesterol levels, avoidance of cardiovascular issues, avoidance of the passage of overwhelming metals in the body, and enhanced athletic execution. That point right there is what I was going for. I would like to be, I like to execute my athleticism in an advanced way. Well, let's try this garlic. We're gonna dig out one of these. Oh, they're like caramelized, bro. Oh, come on. Here's one. I'm gonna give that one to you, Bubba's. Actually, I'm gonna rest it right there for a sec because I gotta use the two forks to get, get the garlic out. Okay, I'll take the bigger one, okay? It Same. smells different. It smells good? That's not as strong. You're right, it's not as strong. That's it. super, it's super hot. Oh. Everybody just want to eat it. I got it right now. No! Well, actually, actually, it's not that bad. It's weird, but it's not it that bad. It's weird. <laughs> I would not eat that on a daily basis. <laughs> oh. So it's not as bad as it was raw? You don't no. like it. He's like, that, I don't like that this. The aftertaste crap. is. Whew. Yeah. It's... Let me just. <laughs> If this is an actual experiment, then I have to do it. And I'm gonna do it, I think, I'm gonna try and do it for at least three days straight. At least. It's gonna be tough. And all in the name of science, too, because that's what it's all about. I mean, it could spread on like a toast or something, or a cracker. Maybe you just wanna swallow it as fast as you can. Three. Three's good. Three's a good number. All right, here's three. Oh my god. Huh. All right, let's move on. Okay, I just went back to the article and now I have to eat three more because look, right here. Right here it says six. Ooh, there's something on my finger. Six roasted garlic cloves. I can't just eat six of, or three of them. I have to eat three more. Here's four. They're big. There's five. There's six. Ah! I want you to try this. I want you to honestly try this. You gotta try it. Please try it. Don't do it because, don't not do it because it's gonna taste bad, but 
Might be good for you, who knows? That's what the article says. And it's only garlic, so. <laughs> She asks me to play Jumpsuit. Like, Jumpsuit's her favorite song, and then she waits till that last part, and she just screams it. I, don't, I did not. Person, you got all that pizza? Yep. You did a good job holding oh. it. Liza, you gonna stay in Nana's and eat dinner, and spend the night, and play with toys and watch movies? Look at this. Yeah? Give me a hug and kiss. <laughs> Give me a hug and kiss. You have fun, okay? Mm. Jeez. Mm. I hijacked some chicken fingers from Nana's box of pizza. Because mm. Carson wanted a chicken finger. And there you go. Now, off to Grammys. To make them and you yep, we're ready? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, and that's the place I used to work. Mm -hmm. Used to make those pizzas. Libby, you ready for your sleep yearly sleepover? Yeah. Yeah, with yeah. the boys? Yeah, we have presents, but we don't get to open them until Christmas. Now normally Grammy <clears throat> has a huge tree that's covered. You can't even see one part of the tree. Um, but this year she just set up this little, it's literally just from here up. And then she's got more presents than this, the, the present selection is bigger than the tree. <laughs> and my she, special yeah, ones are on there. Yeah. Like the one I got in Hawaii this year. Oh, you got one in Hawaii? I got that one in Hawaii this Aww, year. That's so cute. And now, thanks to your hubby, I have my other grandbabies on here. Yeah, All she, my has, grandbabies are on she has pictures of each of the grandbabies. Oh, one's over here. There's Carson. Eliza, Quentin, Cora, Kane. Oh, baby Kane and Cameron. That was the very first one. Baby Colin. Yep, baby Cameron. Yeah, this is the time of the year. These three older ones, the two little ones, Carson, or er, Carson. Quentin and Liza. Grammy's not ready for the, the toddler sleep over yet. I'm not that crazy yet. <laughs> She's not that crazy yet. <laughs> okay, it's cookie time. Grammy already has the dough for the sugar cookie cutouts already made. I'm gonna eat the excess cookie dough. Right there. She told me she made extra this year because right. last year I was like, wait, there's not enough cookies. <laughs> She's got chocolate chip cookies to make. Got all that laid out. He's behind your bed. We used to do this. Bye, mommy. And Brittany, yeah. This is something Grammy's down with. All of us kids and then all of her grandkids. Grandpa's just sitting over here waiting for cookies. No. <laughs> so after they get them cut out, they put them on these cookie sheets with parchment paper so it doesn't stick. This is what we did when we were kids, making cookies. Yeah, Powdered sugar and... Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that was so Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> Your dad's making the powdered sugar challenge. Mm. Just uh, the cinnamon challenge. Yeah. <laughs> we got cookies. The boys are staying the night, but I'll bring lights over in the morning and we're gonna decorate them. Oh. 
It's beautiful. Everyone's doing a great job with their cookies. Look at mine. Dude, that's a great looking star right there, man. I like it. That's your best one? Yeah. Actually, that is a beautiful looking wreath. Yeah, it is. I think it's, I think it's hey. perfect. Hey, hey, hey. This is your famous Santa. My Santas, yes. Yeah, you do a pretty good job on those. Thank you. I've been making them since I was a little girl. Looks like his eyes are a little dry. He needs some clear eyes. <laughs> Look at this scene right here. Everybody's just busy making their cookies, and then it turns into this. What? Look at all these cookies. Yeah, I made that one. Just that one. What do you think? That's my wreath. It's the only one you've made. I know. Is that bad though? I'm not a cookie guy, much like you. You're an expert. Um. That is a beautiful cookie. Liza, you did a really good job. You can eat it. Oh, can I eat that? Yeah. Aww. Yet another year goes by and another family wow. tradition fulfilled. This is how many years in a row has this been going on? You guys decorate oh, cookies you every year. This has been going on 25 years. Oh my gosh. Well, it's 25 years ago, January 1st, that Brian and I met. So, wow. uh, about 24 years, Veronica has been decorating wow. cookies every it's a year. New year. It's a New Year's miracle. <laughs> <laughs> it's a miracle. We're going to carry on with the day, guys. I hope you've had a fantastic time hanging out with us today. We can send you some cookies, maybe. Or just visit your local you know, grocery you store, but you can't get cooked yeah, like this. That's all for us today. Thank you for watching. We can't wait to see you right back here tomorrow.